many inspirations for this book, but that's one that I'd like to share with you guys because I was in second grade when I got that, and you guys are in second grade. So whenever you guys do the best that you, that you can, your teachers always recognize that. Your teachers will say, man, they did such a good job, and they always give you what, a sticker or a star, right? Exactly, or take a ticket. And then you go trade it in to get like a pride, right? Yeah, yeah. Exactly right. So remember that, guys. So I want you guys to know that that will always, that always, I'm 36 years old, and that still has an effect on me today. And so because of that, I have a book of my own that I want to read, well, a book of my own that I want to read to you guys that's the right side up. And it's called I Love the Color Pink The Adventures of Lacey and Casey. I'm going to bring it a little bit because you guys are censored. If it's okay, we're going to score it over here. So I said, since you guys can see me well, I might even stand up with it. Okay? And so I actually wrote the book, and I also drew the pictures for her. Okay? And so it actually came out a couple of weeks ago. And so I'm so excited that I get to share this with you guys during about a reading week. Because I live here, too, now. I'm a resident here, too. And when I moved here, I moved here about a couple months ago, and I was really scared. And in the short time that I've been here, I've met so many friends and so many kids like you, because I substitute teach as well. And I met so many great, great kids like yourselves. So it's such a honor and a blessing to be out here to be able to read this to you. So do you mind if I share my book with you now? Yeah. Well, I don't know if I said my name, but my name is Mrs. Carr. Okay, and this is Monica or Mrs. Carr, either one, I'm fine with, okay? So I'm going to read you my book, okay? It's called I love the 